Okay, we're just minutes away from this beginning. The dogs are excited. Rochester and Logan, they're just like, ooh, ooh, they're here to do a movie about me, but they're more excited about meeting Splenda Lee than me. So we're, she's coming in. You're gonna meet her shortly. I haven't met her yet. I hope she likes my paintings. Okay, do I, I'm gonna go let her in. You all stay back here. Oh, I should take this off. It doesn't work with my ensemble. <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my gosh. This home is absolutely bougie, wonderful. I literally can't believe I'm here at Pat Gordon's place getting ready to interview him. I'm a bit nervous. I, and Norris has not seen me this nervous, but I am a bit nervous. And I literally cannot believe I'm here. But I'm excited, and I am channeling Jean Harlow today, as you can tell with the ensemble, and I just adore her. But I am here, and we're getting ready to go in. Oh, I can't wait. Yay. <laughs> Let's go. All right. Oh, my God. I cannot wait till I can get me a cute boy to carry my bags. We're gonna get there. So anyway, we're walking in. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Chica, honey. <laughs> get oh. back in here, dog. Oh, look at you, darling. Get oh, back here. Get oh, back here. how are you precious pie? <laughs> oh, aren't they, darling? They come I go. saw the picture of you with your dog. Yeah. And it was so cute. Oh, well, Loved it. It's so good. Thanks. I cannot, please come in. I cannot in. tell you how nervous I was. Oh, please. I know, seriously. Quit. You're Quit. you're a star. Oh, you're a star. You and my mother. Well, honey. Come on. <laughs> Mama's, let me tell you come something. On. Oh, darling. Come Mama's, on. no. Oh, I didn't have my shoes on. I've got to put my pumps on. Oh, oh. Cheek of the picture. Oh, honey, she's going to be out for a little bit. Such a gracious way to be met. I know, isn't this great? This one mines. This yeah, one this is a. Oh yeah, you can tell. They're um, female, male, both men, both men. Uh, Love it. Men's. Well, different personalities, I'm sure. Yeah. It's so good. <laughs> you hug. <laughs> I'm good. Please I love come into hug. my studio. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! This is wonderful. I'm going to feel better when I put my shoes put on, if you shoes don't on. mind. Yes, because I have to have that. But, wow. Look at that. Whoa. <laughs> well, you know, are you going to sell it? For the right amount of money. I know. And that's something he needs to do. So anyway, I can't believe that is so cool. Thanks. Yeah, I have to admit, I have to admit it's very cool. And I did a little Googling on you. Yeah. Yes. You're amazing. No, comes and goes. No, seriously, you really are. You <laughs> truly are. Amazing person. Sit down. Relax. I love the chair with the leopard. That's beautiful. Well, thanks. Oh, so anyway, as mom's putting on her shoes, like we said, mamas know when they have a star among them. And you're a star, you know that. <laughs> Seriously, is uh, Mama still with us? No, no. Well, she might be, but well, oh, you're sitting. Oh, oh, you're oh, sitting. Oh, you're sitting in her chair. Oh, that was okay. Me. Here we go. That was my mother's chair. We're gonna invite Mom. Was Mom a lot of fun? Oh yeah. Mom yeah. Was. She 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 has a wonderful spirit. Yeah. I pick up on stuff, uh -huh. and especially when I had my amethyst ring. Cool. It really picks things up. And um, yeah, Mama is a divine lady. Yeah, she was interested. Oh, yeah. Oh, absolutely. She supported you a lot. And she was the artist, uh -huh. too. She's the one that taught you. Well, she got me started, yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah, here we go. All right. So, do, oh, I get to, oh, excuse me, darling. I get to sit over here. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Oh my gosh, as I look around, this, I have to admit, 
out of all of them, this one I just adore. Just adore. Well, thank you. Thank I do, I do. Because it tells me a boy getting into his feminine side, and that's so important. Uh -huh. This guy, yes, tell my, me friend about Pete, him. my friend Benny, uh -huh. work construction. OMG. <laughs> I'm not kidding. He worked construction in the oh, day. Oh. And at home, at night, wow. he made these gowns. He made gowns? He was a dress oh. designer. I kept trying to get oh. him to move to New York. And he did he, and he no, never did. No, he's still here. He's, he's still, still here, here but he has a really wonderful life. And he I wonder if we could convince him to make well, I'm telling you, he is... I'm serious. They work so beautifully vague. Chica, look, I mean, seriously, and I, I hope you don't mind me calling no. him Chica, because I call, when I feel That's comfortable fine. with people, I call him Chica. That's fine. Norris got Chica. <laughs> <laughs> and he started laughing. He's my... Yeah. Anyway, that gown is stunning. Yeah, it really They're just was. elegant. They're just couture. They were. Yeah. Oh, my God. Now, these men... Yes. I think very much... Mm -hmm. In just the brief time I've gotten to know you, I know these guys were about performance. It was a performance mm. art. Yes, yes. You know, I know. They were in touch with his grandmother. Was let me think. His yeah. his mother, his grandmother was Italian, and his <gasps> father was full Cherokee. Whoa. That's why he is so handsome. Whoa. Okay, okay. Um, let me ask you this: You're, Are you familiar with Two Spirit? The term Two Spirit. No. Okay. Oh, yay. That is a modern term for gay Indians. It's a modern term. Because Never heard that. Yes, in 1990, uh, all of these Indian, gay Indians got together and they said, there's something goes more than just being gay. Mm -hmm. Our culture, our spirituality, all of that. So mm -hmm. they said, we're going to be called two spirits. And that That's means that you can walk in both worlds beautifully mm -hmm. without any problem. Interesting. And we don't have to pick a gender to be in. Too spirited. Yeah. Good name for oh, and yeah, it is great. Way. Google so, it, and uh, well, you'll see my name pop up a few times. And uh, I'm a big supporter of the Two Spirited movement. That's cool. Yeah, and it helps all races. I don't know why it helps I've all races. Well, the thing is, it's okay because there's still a lot of people that don't know it. But you'll get to know it. You'll get to know it for sure. We gotta have our phones, don't no, we? No, I really don't. No, no, no. I mean, seriously, we love our phones. I, I do wanted, love. I love my yeah, phone. I you know, of course. But, you know. I didn't want it in my pocket. <laughs> you don't want to spend that a, my niece that, been, My niece <laughs> bent her iPhone. She had it in her back pocket and she sat down and bent it. But, uh, oh, I saw that one on Google. Which, the, one of my daughter. This is your daughter. That's my daughter. <gasps> I love snow. I'm a January baby, and I adore snow. And when I saw that picture, I just thought, what a beautiful girl for one. She Second is. of all, she's staring at the snow when I loved it when it snowed. And uh, wow, tell me a little bit about your daughter. My daughter is a cardiac anesthesiologist. Whoa, brilliant. And runs the brilliant. intensive care, the cardiac intensive care unit at the University of Penn in Philadelphia. Whoa! Yeah, she did. She Daddy's proud. The Daddy. whole opposite way from her father. Wow, but that's okay. Oh, she mine through. Oh my gosh. She's happy as can be. She loves it. She has four children and a darling husband. What did the grandkids call you? Diddy. 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 Do you love? It's what they call me. There you go. There you go. And so they name. came out with that. Yeah. Oh my it's gosh, that's like wonderful. It's, it's uh, <laughs> my moniker. <laughs> Did you really? You know, I... Uh, now, was she your only child? My only child. Wow. And then those are my grandchildren. At least three of them. There's four. Now, is that your dog or their that's, dog? It's, the title of that painting is called Portrait of Rochester Gordon, accompanied by the Farrell children. Oh, how divine. And how divine. their last name is Farrell. Wow, that's that's brilliant. It's brilliant. Wow. And so, do you go see them quite a bit? Yeah, I'm going on Friday this Ooh, week. Yay. What does it do to you when you go there? 
Well, nobody knows I'm an artist. Nobody cares that I'm an artist. Wow. And so, you know, I'm just the grandfather that... That shows up. That shows up. Isn't that neat? Mm -hmm. Isn't that neat? Wow. And the special relationship you have with your grandkids, I'm sure it is... We have one. a good relationship. Do you? Yeah. Well, you're... Yeah. Seriously, down deep, you really are a lot of fun. <laughs> I can tell. I can tell. When you let it out. Yeah, well... When you let it out. We're guarded. I mean, we, we sometimes we have to be. Yeah. You know, you know. But when you're in a situation right now, mm -hmm. I want you to really let go. Because <laughs> we're trying to show that gay people can have a lot of fun. Well, you should. Well, yeah. It's the most Hello. fun you can have with exactly without laughing. Exactly. You know. <laughs> exactly. Tell me what your what. Tell me what's fun with what you love to do. What do I love to uh -huh. do? Well, I have a really beautiful garden, oh. and you know that mm -hmm. is like what mm -hmm. gives me as great a pleasure as painting. Wow! Is garden design your favorite flower? Uh, rose, probably. No. no. Rose or tulip. Because I noticed in your paintings there was a lot of flowers, but there was yeah. rose that really stood out. Because I adore roses. Mm -hmm. You know, I have Elizabeth Taylor in my in my garden. Oh, that's and then, good. Oh, beautiful. I love that rose. Mm -hmm. I absolutely love that rose. And they're still giving me little buds. And when well, I eat, I always put cool. a flower. Yes, yeah. it's cooler. They now love the cool, cool weather like I do. Mm -hmm. And I go out and clip a little one and put it in my little bud face. Uh -huh. And it just gives you joy. It does. That's what flowers are for. Flowers are for that, yeah. Mm -hmm. And so that gives you a lot of joy. Uh -huh. How it fun. Does. How fun. Besides your garden. Yeah. What else? And I like my dogs. I take my dogs oh, everywhere. They're darling. They're darling. I have Butch and Nellie the parakeets. <laughs> Good name. <laughs> well, I, I got those names when I had a dear, dear friend in Houston back in the late 70s, early 80s. And I got, they went to work and I was staying with them and they had two dogs, Butch and Nellie. And the dogs got out. And I'm in this neighborhood in Houston going, Butch, Nellie, Butch, Nellie. <laughs> In a gay community. That in helps. a gay community. That helps. I know. And I had all these guys coming out, <laughs> looking and laughing, yes, wanting to know yes. who this queen was, screaming for Butch and Nelly. <laughs> I have such a combination love. I but, had a real yeah. funny aunt. I mean, just mm -hmm. hysterical. <laughs> and she had a dog named Somebody. Wow. And she'd run outside and she'd just start yelling, <laughs> Somebody! Somebody! Somebody, <laughs> somebody come here! Oh my God. And you just never Do knew. Do you love that? Oh my you God. You never knew who would show up. And they'd probably call that poor lady. And as my grandmother would say, God love her. God love her. God love her. You have a southern here. Yes. Yes. Oh my Butch and Nelly. That's good. Butch and Nelly, yeah. They're my, I had two cats, Flynn and Tally. They lived to be 18 and 16 years mm -hmm. old. And uh, they were the love of my life. I know. College. I know. I know. I know. And... And Flynn would have been my my wonderful scholarly type, the male cat. The other one was female. She was a little skittish. She, she was a strap. Yeah. Yes, she yes, yes. She was a tabby and she was a calico mix. Yeah. And she was orange. Perfect. And that's why I called her Tally. And I love that. Flynn had a little goatee like Errol Flynn. Uh -huh. And so that's where I called him because I love the old movies. Turner Classic is my favorite. And that's why I was channeling Jean Harlow modern day because I love her <laughs> and I was watching Bombshell before I came over and it was like I was painting and watching her and she was cracking me up but then I just said you know after they passed I didn't want anything but you got to have something living around you I think and so I said I'm gonna get birds I tried fish I can't do fish I always tell there are a lot of trouble. There, yeah, I mean, there you have to have trouble. that water perfect, yeah. and, and then you just kind of go, I'm not into those fish. You know, they don't listen to me. And so I thought, I was in a pet store. Yeah, pet store. You can't pet them. You know, you can get Buccinelli on your finger. I am. Oh, I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I can't I know. believe I said like, that. No, please. <laughs> Please oh, go stop. down that path. No, not. Well, you know, I hope later on, um, you know, we met years ago. 
Oh, jeez. Years ago, yeah. I'm not going to say. What no, I'm no, thinking. no. I'm seriously, because Where you're you not think? too much older than I am. I mean, you're just a well, couple let's, of years. Let's just not talk about No, no, we won't talk about that. No, 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 no. We won't talk about that because my, my 99-year-old grandmother, when she left this earth, she said, Now, darling, when somebody asked you your age, you said 39. You pick an age and stick with it. You pick an age and stick with it. Because she said, she was a very wise native lady. She said, you will become what you think you should be if you're not careful. That old age. Yeah, 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 well. Oh, yeah, and if you keep, you know, thinking about it, a lot of people get there. Well, don't you think a lot of people, as they get older, start looking like the inside of who they are? Exactly. On the outside. <gasps> it's so true. That's brilliant. Mm. That is so true. Yeah, because the outer. No, no, no. But seriously, because uh, that outer comes out. I think yeah, so. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. And I literally, these later years are going to be the best years of my life. And they're the best years of your life. Yeah. They really are. They really are. Because you look fabulous. Oh. I'm serious, and you have a laugh. Oh, yeah. If we don't, if you can't laugh at yourself, well, that I can do. And get trashy. <laughs> well, that I've been known to do. I've been known to get it that way. Yeah. But I, I told Norris it was so funny when I'm in my lady attire. I have to be a lady. Now I can be sassy and saucy, but I won't be vulgar. And yeah, so, yeah. That is isn't that funny? Isn't that funny? Because you could cut the F word without a thing if you were. Oh, word. if I went in drag, it'd be, you know, that. And burr, burr, burr. But when I'm female, because my grandmothers, I, I adored my grandmothers. They were so classy. You know, they wore hats, they had gloves, they, they were just bougie. My dad's mom, you know, she was the one that really taught me how to talk how to communicate, things like that. Where are you from? Well, I was born in Shawnee, and originally all Oklahoma. Oh, okay. Yes, yes. Three years in Dallas. Well, that's that's wild. That's as we're 89, 90, 91. You're lucky you're to be here. Well, let me share with you. <laughs> let me share with you. Now. This is something we have to rejoice in, yeah. that we're still here. Yes. Because we were disco. We were disco queens. I mean, that was our era. And I adored the disco. I went, when I first came out, I went every night for a whole summer. Because I was afraid I was going to miss a man. <laughs> Not a man you missed. Not I, a man I missed. I mean, you know, it was like, do we want to wait on a good one or get Mr. Right away? You know, I mean, seriously. Mr. Right for the night. Exactly. And I did, we did that a lot. I did that a well, lot. Well, that was what that... But that was that era. Oh, you know, and, and, and that's something I learned being two-spirited. You, you're in touch with your sexuality. We were, we were expected to be sexual because we taught sex. We were comfortable sexually. Well, yeah, 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 yeah I think. And we had a place to be. And we had a place to be, absolutely. You know, that's mm -hmm. what I see mm -hmm. has changed mm -hmm. in our world now is there oh. are no bars. The, bars are closing. Bars are closing everywhere. And I kept saying, why are bars closing? Because, and, and well, Toby, you know, who's uh, oh, the director, he said, because you can pick up online now. Yeah, you don't have to leave you, the you, house. you have an app that you can pick up somebody and you don't need the bar. Yeah. But... I, I miss the, the I do too. I, I miss the socializing. I love the socializing. It was a very different. Yes, it was. It was a very different world. Yes, it was. Yes, and it was. I think that the youngsters of today have no clue as to, to they, what kind of family they have was none. built in the bar. Exactly. 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 Our family of choice. Yeah. Was made in the bar. Yeah. Because I had wonderful, and I still communicate with them. And I'm hoping, Norris is going to, we're going to interview them, all my disco buddies that are still here. Yeah. And we're going to get together as a big reunion video. <laughs> oh my God, can you imagine? They have so many stories on me. And I told them not to hold back. Well, that's good. Because I want to be raw. You know, I mean, I want to be lady, but I want to be raw and, 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 and embrace everything that I did because it got me where I am now. True. True. But we met at Riverside. I had an apartment down on Riverside. Yes, yes, yes. You probably would know me. At one time I had buzzed hair and a big bushy mustache. 
looked very Castro clone. And uh, yeah, and I just thought you were a fun guy. Well, I was. I was young. And, and you still are, but well, I haven't. I mean, this was back in the 80s. Yeah, I mean, this yeah, was yeah. in the 80s. Because I moved back in, well, no, I moved away in 79. I moved here in 79 and stayed till 84 and then moved to Dallas. And then That's came back in the 84. World. I know. And we're still up and then and living. I know. And then 2003, you moved to New York. I did. Isn't that fabulous? Uh, yeah. Did you love New York? Yeah. Yeah, I loved it. What did you love doing? Besides painting, because, well, I painted a lot. And I went to the museums a lot, yeah. which we don't see them a lot, yeah. which we don't. We have good museums here. Down, yeah. yes. Not like New York. Not like New York. I mean, it's just, I mean, was, uh, just walking out to get coffee or to, mm -hmm. I mean, it's mm -hmm. just taking the dog out. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I can't remember his name. But a porn star that you would know lived on my block. And I got to know him because he liked my dog. Oh, and oh. so, and it was so much fun. We would talk, and I'd think, I've seen you naked. I've seen you naked and seen doing you sex. sex. Yeah, but I bet he was a lovely. But he guy. was such a nice. And guy. you don't remember his name? Oh, isn't that terrible? Oh my God, was it Al Parker? No, but I loved. Oh, Al I loved Parker. Al Parker. He was Al one of my Parker. favorites. Yeah, he was, he he was, was so first good. Coming out, really. Al Parker was. Oh, my he dream. was the dream. Oh. oh my gosh, and Tab, Tab, Tab Hunter. Tab Hunter. Yes, was, yes. Straight Tab Hunter. Straight was Tab movie. Hunter was in gay movies. Uh -huh. Now that took a lot of acting. I doubt it. I doubt it. Don't you? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm going to get trashy here for just a second, but a mouth is a mouth. You know? Well, that's what I've been told. It, it's, but, it's mostly true. And you know what's so funny? And I was telling this to Norris, and he was just cracking up. You know, straight men. It's so funny. I'm because I'm very feminine. In the gay, in the gay hooking up, I don't have as much luck at all, at all. But when I put Splenda Lee on one of the straight web pages, I had 150 hits a week from these men wow. that were married and had girlfriends wow. because they loved a chick with a little extra. <laughs> yeah. Well, and. Yeah, isn't that fascinating? Isn't that fascinating? Yeah, yes. Because I was blown away. Now, I don't want to say and be, be rude or anything, but they weren't my kind of people. I mean, they weren't my kind of men that I wanted to be yeah, with, yeah. really. No, but it was the rush. That it was the rush of going, scratching your head, going, wow, that was amazing to have those men wanting you. I can't imagine. So I know it was it was a it was fascinating. It was very fascinating. I mean, they were adamant about it, and they were all straight. <laughs> Just incredible! Isn't, isn't that incredible? Isn't yeah. that incredible? And you know, for a gay man, you know that was the that was the ultimate, ultimate to get a straight man yeah. to go to bed with you. That was the ultimate. Yeah. Uh, well, for me it was. Well, for me it was. Because that was kind of a fantasy come true. And I had it a lot. And, you know, because I was feminine. I, I do believe, because I really got in touch with my feminine, but you know, during that period, you know, you can't be Nelly. And so I had to butch it up and wear the big mustache and shave the head and, you know, talk like this. <laughs> <laughs> You know, butch it up, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, you're maybe not butch it up. Just no way. Oh. You know, as butch as it is, it's, I put up a storm window. By I myself. I love it. By myself. I was See? so impressed. You got it. You got butch and did it. Yeah. I got butch and put up my storm window. Don't you love it? Well, That's I cool. was surprised. Now, do you like to entertain? Well, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Do small dinner parties, things small like that. Small dinner parties. I do a lot of mm -hmm. what I call charity entertainment. Oh, I that. have people who will, at a charity, yes. they will pay X amount of dollars to come here for dinner, and so they'll eat dinner in a studio or they'll eat dinner in the oh. gallery upstairs. And I like doing that. Mm -hmm. I mean, it mm -hmm. raises money for somebody, and I get to sit down and eat dinner with eight people I may or may not know. You know what I call that? Great karma. 
Well, yeah, I, I believe that. Karma. I believe that. You do. Mm -hmm. You have great karma. Okay. I mean, you're very successful. You're very respected. I mean, anytime I mentioned your name, because we, you know, we were building up to this, and every, oh, his beautiful artwork, all of the things he does for charity, I just thought, how marvelous. Well, yeah. I'd like you to be able to do it. Sure, sure, sure. You know, so I, have, I host dinners and yeah, yeah. fundraisers mm -hmm. for mm -hmm. politicians. And Ooh. I had one this year. It was a lot of fun for Tim Gilpin, who I hope will be the next mm -hmm. Um, mm -hmm. senator from here. Oh, yeah. I oh, yeah. I've heard, some, I've heard some great things about him. I really do. I've heard some great things about him. Are you for the mayor? Um, yeah. Lee Edmondson. Yeah. 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 Oh, I'm a Democrat. So am I. Let me. Oh, I go. Oh, yeah. listen. My, my dad worked for LBJ. Oh, my gosh. We did. See, I love. So I go love. back to the 60s where mm -hmm. I was mm -hmm. going to political fun things with my dad. I love oh that. Gosh, mm -hmm. That is really cool. You know, my grandmother was very, she was a staunch Democrat. Mm -hmm. And my best friend in high school, when I turned old enough to register, was a Republican. And Janie Davis and I remember she goes, "Now we need to, we need to, you need to come down here with me, and we're going to register Republican." I didn't know. I didn't know the difference between Republican and Democrat. I didn't. You know, I just knew I could vote. Mm -hmm. So I registered Republican, and I came home with my card, and my wonderful stoic grandmother is sitting there, and I go, "Grandmother!" I called her Mama. Mama, Mama, look, 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 look! I'm a Republican, and I get to vote. She looked at oh, oh, she looked at it, and then she went and got her gloves on. She put her hat on. She put her lipstick, and she said, "You're coming with me." And I thought, "Oh no, what have I done? Oh my God!" I thought maybe she was going to, you know, introduce me to all these Republicans. I didn't know she was Democrat. I mean, she never shared that with me. Yeah. She took me down there, and we changed it. She said, "You're going to change that." You will not be a Republican. You will be a Democrat, and we're changing it now. And I thought, whoa! But we were so close, and and I respected everything she did. Sure. And she was brilliant. She was a brilliant. Well, lady. she was yeah. leading you down the right path. Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely. You know, it's nice to talk to somebody that shares the same political views because it's really tough nowadays. My doctor loves when I come in because he goes. You're the only one I get to talk to and really share how I feel about what's going on. You know? Yeah, it's. I, I am very vocally pro Democrat. Yes, yes. I am a progressive. I, Me too. I just Me can't too. believe the stuff we watch now. Well, you know. And I watch it every day, all day. Do you really? Oh my, my gosh. So you know everything. Really? If I need to know what's going on, I all can. Day. Okay, I will. I will. Oh. I'm going to, okay, may I ask you a question? Do you like to be called Pat or Patrick? You what can do you call me anything you want, honestly. Oh, how, I feel honored, I feel you, yeah. can, you yeah. can call me Butcher, you can call me Nelly. I don't really care. I love it's, or Chica. Chica. Yeah. Uh, Pat is what I was raised with. Mm -hmm. um, the reason I went from P.S. to Patrick. You're right. Was because I was in New York I was at the Plaza Hotel, and my dealer called, and, my painting dealer uh -huh. called and said, "Get up! They're going to show a print of yours today on Regis Philbin." <gasps> oh, that's exactly how I felt. My Did heart. you just get excited? Oh, oh my God. gosh! I know, I know. I mean, that's you. So I got up and I turned on the television. Uh -huh. I got my coffee, and I'm sitting there, and. It's Regis Philbin with some guy who's a de an art dealer down on Broadway somewhere. Oh. And they were talking about prints and they had just shown a Rembrandt print, and which you can still buy Rembrandt prints. Oh, sure. They just sure. keep making them. <laughs> anyway, they said, but now we're talking about the young artists that are coming along. Wow. That are emerging mm -hmm. as the next Picassos, which I'm not. Well, you're, you but, no, you But really I had ability, to and he said, and so we're going to talk about those in the next segment. But before we go, mm -hmm. I want you to see what we're going to talk about. And they had this big uh, rectangle covered in black velvet. Oh, my God, there. talk about a lead up. Oh, wow. And they pulled it <gasps> off, and it was my print, and the audience went, <gasps> And they went to commercial, and I thought, oh my God, na nationwide. 
Whoa! So they came back, and Reed just says to what the, the guy, that? I don't even remember. You don't remember what it uh-huh. <laughs> But it had to be a portrait. Are you, no, 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 it, it was wasn't? a still life. It was a print. Wow. And my print dealers were in New York, and uh, Reed just said, well, uh, that, this is really beautiful, but what does the PS stand for? And the dealer looked at him Ooh. and said, Pamela Sue. And I was just like, what? Pamela Sue? And he said, a lot of women sign their paintings by their initials rather than put their female name because women get the short end of the stick in the He's pe- going in the on and business. on and, and on about all this. The Are you serious? Oh, telling me oh, all the precious. reasons of why <laughs> and what my name was. Whoa. Pamela Sue. I just sat there. I bet you were stunned. I was just, um, and my dealer just went nuts at the <gasps> television. Station at NBC and did he do that on her? I mean, was no, he no, that? no, 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 no. He just assumed because a lot of women do Bad sign time. their initials P S. So when I moved to New York, I thought we're not letting this happen this time. No, absolutely so I not. Started signing my paintings, Patrick. So there would be no question. Isn't that amazing? And that's, how, and that's why. Wow. Whoa. After all those years. Now, did you ever get to meet him and talk to him mm-hmm. about it? Never, no, I did. never did. Never did. I wish you had a. Well, I would have liked to. Yeah, yeah. But this is Pam. Gore. Yeah, Pamela Sue. <laughs> hey, Darla, this is Pamela Sue. Yeah. My Could drag, be your drag name. My, my drag name's Mar a Lago. <laughs> Are you serious? How divine. Not really. How divine. I've you never serious? done drag. Can you believe it? You know it? what? I, it was so funny. I, I was thinking when I was getting ready at my vanity, and oh my gosh, my vanity, I, I adore. I'm there a lot of bit, a lot, a lot of times. And anyway, I was saying, you know, we were talking about putting you in a tuxedo. And I said, why don't we just put him in drag? <laughs> Have you ever been in drag? Uh, never. Been, weirdly enough. But you never wanted to. Mm-hmm. Isn't that funny? I wanted to paint it though. But you love painting it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I thought, you know, these paintings are 20 years old. Are you still? Oh. That was done 20 years but ago. This, this, I mean, this is something that I, my dream is to have over my fireplace, is a portrait of me in my, in my most divine outfit. Just, just captured in his, because this is going to be around for centuries. I hope so. It will be. I hope so. And that is amazing. That's why I just love paintings. You know, we're we're so you know into pictures and things like that, but paintings, yeah, amazing. Can we cut? Because I need a. Better... Yes. So I cannot wait. For a tour. Okay, come Can on. we do? Can we do? Yay. Let's go. All right. Here we go. And I know the darlings are going to follow us. Okay, boys. Come on. All right. There Here you go. go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it takes my breath away. It does. It, ta- it, it, it takes my breath away. It just... Oh, and the kitty. The kitty. Uh, now, a cat named Utica. Utica. Uh-huh. It was whoa. My now, friend Marty's cat. It was photographed in my friend Marty's living room. Now, Marty lived here or lives here? He lives here. He used to be my next door neighbor. Is he straight? No. Okay. Okay. I was just curious. I was just curious because the other guy was straight. Right? No, no. Oh, he no, wasn't. No, oh, no. oh, okay. But he no, was construction, and I but just see how he is That you know. Hello. Wow. And so this is this is, is, the is first one. This no, no. This is my friend Ken, Ooh. the florist. Yay. And I found them at an AIDS fundraiser back in the nineties. Oh my gosh! Dressed up like this, early nineties. Maybe late 80s. That's beautiful. And uh, I was so impressed with Ken's mm-hmm. outfit. And that <laughs> little bald head and that perfectly perfect oh. little pearl tiara. <laughs> I almost wore my tiara. 
But it was. Too, I thought it was just way too much. much. For yeah, it was just too, well. It's if it would have been evening, yeah, it would have been different. different. Yeah, yeah. I still a pretty wild for the day. How gorgeous! So this it, was the first one. This there, was the very. There first were nine one. of them all together. Then, but the others have been sold. The other ones. There were nine, and you have two three. left. Three left. Of three. Whoa. <gasps> so they're just and now. His cat. His cat. And it was my sofa that I took over there, and the cat just came in the middle of the photographs and joined us. And Cats like, are amazing. Yeah, well, they're, I mean, they're, they're moody. They are. They're very moody, and they love attention, then they don't want attention at all. I mean, seriously. They just absolutely... They run the house too. Yeah, well, they, they do, do. and they, they run mine. They ran mine absolutely they because, do. you know, and they would take over. So the cat just jumped on the couch. Uh -huh. I love it. I love it. Wow. So that was in it. This one was done in New York. Ooh. This was my friend Michael Starr, who mm -hmm. was who went to Harvard, got an acting degree, and this is what he did with it. And wow. uh, but Michael was one of the most talented men. Uh -huh. He was uh, Miss Sobriety in 2005, I think. Woo! And uh, he's beautiful. He's just he's beautiful. incredible. And he travels with a makeup artist, and he travels oh, with a hairdresser. Oh, oh dream. Uh -huh. A dream. Uh -huh. Yes, a dream. And an entourage of cute boys carrying your bags. Carrying it, the bags. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. Now, does he still perform in I, New York? You know, uh, I don't know. Okay. I don't know. Wow. He moved to, to Massachusetts. I don't know if he's still there or not. But he was really talented, he's and I gorgeous. felt like I had to pay Yeah, him. you do. Yeah, you do. And he was a good friend of yours, uh -huh. too. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So wow. now we're going to go into the Yay. living room. Okay, cool. Now, this is a collection. Yes. Of, I oh, this is a collection. Yes. Of things I collect with my hands. Small things. Love. Things I can hold with my hands. Oh, so love. Cute. And so, uh, oh, so I, I try and find so uh, small I, I try and find small, small buildings or small oh, wow. Wow. stuff. Well, that's beautiful. I do too. I, I adore stuff and pretty things. You know, now that I'm over, I have my own money. I can buy anything. You see, I was limited. You know, I'm a preacher's kid. Hello. Oh, that's a whole story. You know, hello. That's a whole story. But things, I was not allowed to have pretty things or feminine things. But when I got older, and I begged for it. But when I got older, I said, I'm full of dolls. So my home is full of dolls and things that I couldn't have when I was younger. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Look at this crown. Absolutely. Look at this crown. Love the queen. Just in case you do you love the queen. Do you love the queen? The queen. I love it. 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 Because I love it. I love it. I love it. Because you know, it's good to be around our own kind sometimes. Sometimes, because we feel we feel so, gorgeous. All right, that's Absolutely. what I collect are hearts. Gorgeous. So, all right, that's what I collect are hearts. And then this is the largest watercolor I ever made. <gasps> wow! Whoa! Wow! That's amazing. It I made it. That's amazing. I made it in New York. It I made it. In so New, I made it in New York. I it at some friend's house one night. I photographed it at some friend's house one night for dinner, and they had, and they had mm -hmm. that incredible, incredible terrace. Oh. That overlooked New York. Mm -hmm. uh, in fact, these are New York. My closest mm -hmm. In fact, these York. are my closest friends from New York. Dan and Drew. Uh, mm -hmm. and, uh, Dan and Drew. Those are water. Mm -hmm. And uh, I had those are watercolors. I had to make that. Those are watercolors. I had to make that. Those are watercolors. I had to make paintings up because I knew it was. And I do, but we're still very close. And I do, but we're still very close. But you could probably go to New York. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's been a habit. In a but while. It's so, been a while. Yeah. So uh, I love that. So you took the picture and then you just came I back love and that. So you took the picture yeah. and then you just came back and said, I have to. And people often ask. Yes. Uh, and and people often ask. Well, yes. Uh, when did I start paying? Well, my mother managed to save oh, a few things. I was this six was years old. Oh, I was six dog. years old. Oh, lady. This was our dog. And, lady. Uh, that's brilliant. And for six year old. Uh, that's that's she died. For six year old. Because she died. Well, six. She's probably old. Well, she's never run over. I guess. She's probably oh, no. old. But she got run uh, over, I think. Anyway. Oh, no. But that was uh, one that my anyway, mother kept. Anyway, that was one that my mother kept. This is beautiful. my granddaughter, Amy. Wow. 
That this is, is my granddaughter Ava. You can just look oh. at her eyes. And you can say, just look at her eyes and say, love. "Just she a love. is a love. Just she a love." Is. Oh wow! Yes, she the is. Oh wow! Yeah. Does she have the personality to match? She rules. Oh yeah. Oh, she's divine. She rolls. Look at that. Oh, and the oh, painted she's toe. She's divine. Wow. Look at that. Oh, and the painted toe. <laughs> down, to down, to, <laughs> down to the, down to the, down to the absolute detail. Oh, nice. So nice. So fun. Love. Absolutely. This here. This was a painting. Obviously, this is the sofa for the dogs. You can tell. I the love it. Sleep. Yeah, right it's there. It's there. It's there. It's, it's their, their sofa. sofa. Absolutely. Whoa. Tell me about this. Uh, in May of 2010, uh -huh. I was in New York. My apartment overlooked the Hudson River. Ooh. Now, when the plane hit, the yeah. Oh, River, oh, oh, yes. I was on the phone. I watched the whole thing. You were there. 39th and one block off. Oh, I could see it from God. my apartment. It was incredible. I was on the phone to Craig Kallenberger and I said, Craig, this is history. There's a 742 out in the middle of the river and there were people on the wings. And he oh was like, Oh my God. Oh, isn't that amazing? Anyway. Oh, isn't that amazing? <laughs> I watched you it happen. It was just you literally a, watched a block it. from my house, from wow. my apartment. 10th floor. Anyway. Yes. Uh, this is a view of Elizabeth, New Jersey. And oh. once a day for 30 days, uh -huh. there was no set time. I would do a painting of one section of Elizabeth, New Jersey.